forgot to pull this thing up again. Wait. You know what? Forget it. We're not going to say that every time. We're talking about Meet Dave today. Um, I'm I've, Dave. I've, wanted, I've wanted to see this movie since it came out. As a, and I'm You've never seen this? Saw trailer, so it, nope. I've, I've never had an ability... Uh, I've never had the ability to watch it before. Um, I had no means of watching it. Or, like, What's I had no way to watch it. about... I mean. I- don't know if I've seen it. Uh, he's just he's he's uh, he's a robot man controlled by little people. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. That's all I remember. Just like R two D two. Yeah, except these little people are probably paid more. Uh, <laughs> Rest in peace, R two D two. The robot's alive. No, no the the guy who plays him. He's not R two D two. He was the guy that plays R two D two. He's not a robot. Not a robot. He's a man. <laughs> He's a man in a robot suit. Yeah. <laughs> he was one of the best people in the world. He was gone too soon. We all wanted to gone hear a enough. trash can cuss. <laughs> you know he cussed because they beeped out everything he said. <laughs> this is so vulgar. At least that's what uh that's what my teacher once said. Man, <laughs> how do you watch this? That robot is cussing so much. <laughs> you can't even hear so a single weird. thing he says. He it's he's cussing joke. too much. They censored him. Such a dad joke. Mhm. Uh, mhm. You guys mm-hmm. have you guys never seen this movie? Never seen. I don't it. think so. To, I've wanted to Wait, since when 2008. When did it come out? 2008. I've wanted to since I saw the TV commercials in 2008. Nobody. I don't think anybody talks about this movie. Well, Ooh, the budget was 60 million. Be a trendsetter. Budget was 60 million and made about 50 million. Ooh. USD at least. Well, that's just US though. I don't know about worldwide. I'm, I'm, I doubt they made it. <laughs> Dang. Well, we don't have much to say about this in the intro because you guys have never seen it, but I have. I'm just going to say Eddie Murphy's a robot. (gasps) Eddie Murphy's a robot? Does he have a death ray laser? Don't you? Are there teenagers that live inside him so that they can do karate? Kinda? Still kind of. (laughs) <laughs> okay, we should go watch it because we don't got anything to say about it because we've never seen it. Well, I haven't seen it. I have. Oh, well, what's your general thoughts on it then? It was it was pretty good. I haven't seen it in like I haven't seen it in like half a decade. Well, <laughs> we're gonna go watch it. We're gonna go All right, it. meet Dave. If he acts like he's from out of this world, <laughs> that's because he is. Hello, sir. Hi. Are you alright? Our first verbal encounter. Thank you for your concern. How hard did he hit this guy? Eddie Murphy. Oh, that's our cat. Cat. Here we go, sir. We're under attack. Meet Dave. Well, that was aggressively mediocre. Yep. That was... That was disappointing. The film has a very interesting take. Reminding me of films such as Osmosis Jones or the television series Herman's Head. Kenny, what are you talking about? Herman's Head. It was a 1990s TV show about all of these little people living inside of the mind of a man, taking the form of personifications of his anxiety, his lust, his desires, and many, many other logistical things. It was a rather interesting concept that has been done pretty well, yet has been covered much better in simpler films such as Inside Out by Disney Pixar. Gindy, this is Meet Dave. Why are you so philosophical? I like how Gindy has slowly got an accent as he was saying that. (laughs) In the world are you referring to? It is me, the Gendy, as you say.
They know too I'm much. Confused. They know too much. Yeah, the so I pretty much predicted the ending. I, I pretty much predicted the ending of this movie. So he didn't salute. He said he would salute. My guess was that Eddie Murphy, the little Eddie Murphy man, comes out of his ear. The woman sees him, and, they, and she, he like salutes at her, and then they fly off in the ship. Essentially, what happened? He yeah, came they... out of the tongue. It, it, it happened, but it didn't happen. He came out of the tongue. Um, he almost saluted, but he didn't, and then they flew off at the end. And the Federal know, like... Bureau of Investigation had attempted to take him away, only they, for them they, to they, seek refuge in his footwear. They flew off in that mad drip. Oh, yes, yes, the drip was quite mad. <laughs> I don't... That, that movie... Hey, what the, are you the doing I, in there? The one thing I quote, all, I quote, like, almost... Like... like I quote like almost in every opportunity that someone's in his old navy or see old navy. I go, "Welcome to old navy." <laughs> uh, I just do it. Um, I just guys, do it. who was huh? that at my phone? Huh? Why is there another me? Wait, wait, what? Give me this. Give me this. What the <clears> heck? The camera app, Gandhi. No, 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 not that, not that. There was there was another guy here pretending to be me. Had a freaky robotic voice. And that's your reflection, Gundy. No. No, he's like yeah. metal. Cold. Metal Sonic. <sighs> metal Sonic. Not to be confused with Metal Sonic. <laughs> wait, wait. Are we talking the Metal Sonic from, like, uh, the Genesis or the modern one? Pop's a huge Sonic well, nerd yes. and a big Sonic nerd, too, so... Yep. Just to clarify. <laughs> I've been holding back on the Heck, references. I, re <laughs> I recently blew his mind when I told him there was an arcade system made by Nintendo, Sega, and Namco. Huh. It was called the Triforce. Oh my god, Zelda? And for whatever reason, Sega distributed an arcade version of an F Zero game. So, so what would what would you guys rate uh, Meet Dave out of ten? I give it about a no. four, six. No, not a five. Uh, three. I wouldn't the, go out of my way to watch it again. The concept works. I like the idea, but it's kind of bogged the down. I was like aggressive. The for... It was, it was really mediocre, dude. I like the trailer for the movie more than the movie, honestly. The editing hasn't aged great. <gasps> the green oh, screen. No. Talk about also, Kevin Hart in the cup. <laughs> I, I love the it. whole <laughs> and and I have a bunch of friends on MySpace, and I'm going on a J date. Can't tell them about Kevin Hart in the cup. Yeah, about to say that. Yeah, let me talk. Um. Never thought I'd see the day where I see Kevin Hart in a coffee cup, poorly, poorly edited in there. It, how how hard would it have been to get like a relatively large like pool and fill it up with like brown water for Kevin Hart to swim around in? Yeah. Because if you look at his arms moving, you can tell that he's just like, like he just I don't know how the word is. It's like they but put a toy just, and just no, superimpose no. this face on it. No, 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 no. You can tell he's not even in the water or anything. He's just, just sitting in front of a green screen and just flailing his arms around. They just, like, he's really feathered. Like, if, like, if, you, if you, like, on his outline, he's, like, feathered on his outline. That means he's, like, his, like, outline fades in, fades into the cup. And it just looks really... It looks like they took Kevin Hart, right? Took his body and cropped it in, like, a, like, a, like, a, like a, cur at a curve. And then took the footage of him, took the footage of him and put it in a coffee cup. That's essentially what it looks like they did. That's why yeah. what they did. <sighs> I tell you, Kevin Hart deserves better. Yep. Sure do. I or will never it? understand the practical effects used in this movie. Like, seriously. <sighs> Honey, I Shrunk the Kids came out in the 80s. And they could get yep. the milk to look like milk. Because it was milk. It's milk. Yeah, but... 
they gotta like they gotta like do the model and things. Like the Cheerios in that movie, they looked real. Looked. Granted, the scale of how how tiny they were was kind of weird. Like, how is it that you can fit in a Hot Wheel yet you're somehow tinier than the diameter of a Cheerio? Well, you see, I don't know. I'm just saying. A Cheerio is not a hula hoop. Yeah. Oh, honestly, they're... Cheerio is hula hoop. Um, their and the Honey, I was... Shrunk the Kids movies got weirder. Like, I remember... Honey, I... Honey, the, I third the, kids one... Is, uh... the third one was called Honey, I Blew Up the Kid. I remember hearing that name for the first that time, was, that, and I was thinking, that, 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 oh that, crap, did that, they that, blow that, him up with a bomb? That was the second one. No, no, the Third second one was up. Honey, We Shrunk Ourselves. No, it wasn't. No. Wait, what? No, it's Honey, We Shrunk, honey, no. we shrunk the Kids, Honey, We Shrunk Ourselves, and no. Honey, I Blew Up the Kid. No, Honey, I Blew Up the Kid was the second one. People, people just don't know, know that. A what? Look oh, at I'm not remembering this wrong. Hold up. I think I shrunk the kids had a budget of eighteen million, and they made um twenty two, no two hundred twenty two point seven million. That's Are they good? Amazing. Their budget was eighteen million. So, yeah. Wait. Oh, what? By the way, if you Honey, hear, if I you blew hear... up the kid was ninety two. Wow. If you hear. That's me typing on my keyboard. keyboard. Also, apparently they're making a fourth movie that got that entered development back in 2019 called Shrunk. (sighs) That's for Disney Plus, I'm pretty sure. And they even did a uh, TV show. Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, the TV show with Kevin Murphy by Kevin Murphy. It had Let's three see. seasons? What? Let's see what reboots, remakes, and other things are coming to Disney Plus, huh? Shall we? Mm-hmm. What year was it born? I can't Why wait for Zootopia Plus. That's going to be an interesting one. I was born in 1920. That's a stupid, there you go. That's a stupid name. Hey, it's I'm better than what, what they did where they keep saying the series. Like, Big Hero 6, the series. Like, you're going to mistake the... Show. Like, you're gonna mistake the show for the movie when they look nothing alike. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, um, Enchanted 2 is coming. Is coming. I, I really? honestly I cannot believe... Yeah, I cannot yeah, believe that like, they're making Enchanted 2. It like, like a year ago. Wasn't there, like, a whole legal issue with that where the original actress was the only person allowed to portray that character? I don't know. That we know about we know about like that was the one reason like, they like couldn't make the princess from Enchanted an official Disney princess due to the oh due to the oh, legal they're reasons action. they're making a live action Robin Hood the movie about a, a cartoon fox okay oh uh, dear it's probably just gonna it's be gonna like, like yeah <laughs> it's just a little like Swiper in the Dora movie <laughs> okay how bad are we talking are we talking like early Sonic movie, or are they just gonna make everyone human-washed? Um, you can just, he's just gonna, like, uh, swipe her in the Dora movie. It is gonna be the worst thing, and it's also gonna be the best thing. My mm-hmm. only request oh, yeah, is the... that they don't make it look like the cats and cats. Oh, yeah, the <laughs> Dora kid reboot. It's it's okay, reboot. Like... You don't know what a reboot, reboot like to... Okay. 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 Um, I like the that would be good. The uh, the image that they released, where it's like a CGI it's not, movie. They... Wait, it's not an image. It's an actual video. What? It's an, an actual video. video. Like well, it's a short <laughs> animation <laughs> clip. I only saw a video. Okay, I like everything about it, but. 
I don't like how he's skin colored. Yeah. Yeah. It, 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 how cursed it was in Pop Tropica. Ugh. We don't bring that up. Pop Tropica was a good game, but it had, but that was like that that world nightmare. Yeah. I'll look this video up. Uh, I, I don't know. I, you, you know something? I like yeah. the original, I like the original Die of Wimpy Kid movies. The, you know, the original three. Uh, yeah. You and know. then they went too far you know, with the, the good ones. other one. But I mean, the guy who played Roderick was kind of supportive of the other guy. He's like, okay, other actor, I... I'm passing off the torch. You're an honorary Roderick in my eyes. I'm watching the clip. Oh, good. But if you ask me, they should have just kept the style of the book. I I, I like I like the live action of it. Yeah, because that had pieces of the book animated. Yeah. My only problem with it, I don't like how they fused the third and fourth book into one movie. Granted, The Last Straw was kind of a duller book in the series, but... Last Straw, fun fact, was actually the one that got me into the series. I have currently... All the mainline books, except for Dog Days. I have yet to find Dog Days. I have them all on hardback. That was something I've been trying to do. I'm trying to get them all on hardback. I have them all except for Dog Days. I, think I, I could buy Dog Days at any point. Stop collecting them after. <laughs> what was the ninth book? Um, can't tell. Let me just count. Three, six. Nine, um, old school. Oh, oh, old school. Then, uh, sure. I stopped at hard eight? lock. I love that in um, Home Alone. Oh, Buzz, your girlfriend. It just looks like Rally, Rally in a wig. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It legitimately does. <laughs> just Rally. Hey, sometimes it just happens. Do, can we appreciate? Can we appreciate how like amazing the casting in that movie is? Oh yeah, it's uh, it's something else, man. So the more I look into it. A lot of the Hefleys have some sort of unlikable trait to them. That's kind of the point. Gendy. I don't know, it's just... Uh, Greg, Greg, Greg is, is a, kind Greg of a is sociopath. A sociopath. Yeah, he's, a so- he's a sociopath. Roderick uh, is... Well, they, bring, they bring it up in the movie. <laughs> he's like, you know what, Greg? You're a bad friend. You know? I saw, I saw an no animated <laughs> parody of that where they... Somebody actually, like, tried to make cartoon versions of the, uh, of the actors in the movie. And in the cartoon, they just have Rowley point a gun at Greg and shoot him. Probably should save this for when we do a Diary of of a Wimpy Kid episode. Yeah, but that could be a while. Wow, well, again, it's, I'm, not, I'm kidding. It's not next week because I don't know what we're doing next week. <laughs> we were going to do Night at the Museum. But then I was like, as we were like recording the intro, I'm like, oh, you know what? We should do Meet Dave. We should have done my That was a yeah. mistake. We could have watched yeah, it. We should... <laughs> uh, Dude, but, you know, Night there's the always Museum. other chances. I mean, the 2000s is full of movies. Uh, and if you ask me, and if you say things like, Oh, but Grumpy Cat wasn't in the 2000s. Yes, we know, but that style, that 2000s style didn't really die until 2014, if you ask me. The 90s didn't end until 2004, and the 2000s didn't die until 2013. I'm just saying. Gundy, it's, true. it's true. I love how Gundy just like, carries this entire podcast. <laughs> We just appreciate him for Carried a second. It all. How, how he just... <laughs> Have you no, ever like, played we, that we, one we'll, creepy we'll Pokemon God. CD-ROM game? Swear to God, I'm just trying to talk, woman. 
So, anyways, <laughs> um, so again, <laughs> <laughs> uh, did you guys ever? Eh, never. I'll I'll leave I'll leave questions for when we do the video. Well, I'm gonna oh. forget to ask this ah. question, so I'll just say it now. Did you guys ever write your own diary as a kid? Because because of um diary of a wimpy kid. Yeah, I straight up like straight up, like I would do. I would like to think like whenever I would do a story or something, it, it would have like the text, and then it would have the um, pictures because you like a straight up like rip off of how dumb they did it. But I never did like a diary of a kid thing. Like three of my own handwritten ones, and then one Christmas I got the do-it-yourself book. Hey, uh, hey. When I was a kid, I, I would I watch Wally a lot. So, and it was Christmas time, so I, did, I, I, I wrote a Wally Christmas fan fiction. <laughs> That's, That's adorable. It was... Eva. <laughs> they just, oh, they just Wally. Celebrate Christmas and all of us get like, something that, they, that was in the movie that was, that was like, broken. <laughs> First, the blue sky and the grass. I remember I was watching Wally with someone, and I saw the line, "Where's the blue sky?" And I'm like, "Oh no, the ship's captain has had a drug overdose. He's a drug <laughs> addict. All that time in space is messed with his head. He needs he needs the drugs to get through." Hey guys, hey guys, guess what? Huh? Hey guys, guess what? No. What? The Diary of Wimpy Kid movie came out 11 years ago. Oh. Greg? Greg is going to be 23 this year. Wow. I. Oh my god. How am I younger than Greg? They were born in 1998. Both him and um, Rowley. Roderick is going to be. Why does he look like he's been smoking pot? He looks sad in this picture. In the first picture you see, oh my god, he's gonna be thirty this year. Roderick might no be a heart. TikToker now. He, he looks like, like he's a TikToker. One? You know, he's on TikTok. If I'm not mistaken, he was from oh. Europe, I think. Canada. What? Yeah, it's just Canada. Just... Just oh, French, Canada. Just French Alaska. <laughs> French Alaska. That's, that's just that's just uh. French that's just French Alaska and um Australia is just the, the Texas of Europe. Hey, hey, if you think about it in Meet the Robinsons, they said Canada was gonna be New Montana. <laughs> soon, soon. Oh God. I bet that ta- I bet that takes place in like two thousand like like 2022 or something. It, I, um, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure it had a definitive date. Let me look it up when it was. Oh, God. Um, it's going to be like a few years ago. Robinsons. Hey, as long as it's love... not the Meet the Robinsons <laughs> video game. Oh, it's, um, it's 2037. Oh. Wait, wait. Because, oh, Ooh, that's oh, not it's... as as long as long as long. That's not as far away as you think. Yep. <laughs> hey. But heck, that means we that means we do get Canada some point. In 2077. 37. 2077. Uh, why was Goob <laughs> such a mood? Hey Goob, cool they binder. Hey, you want to come over and play? They all hated me. <laughs> you gotta say it more like they all hated me. They all hated. Me. Like Meet the Robinsons is a man. good movie. I like me. I love Meet the Robinsons. That's such a good movie. Yeah, <laughs> it's so a movie aggressive. that teaches you about failure and how it's good for hey, you. Back away from your microphone, good lord. I'm sorry, my my power my power is acting weird. For some reason, the lights have uh, flickered, and uh, my laptop's charger isn't working. Gunny, g- g- d- did your phone ring? No. Okay, good. Whew. Did your phone ring? Let me know. Because if no one's there... Who's calling? If your phone rings and no one's there... 
No, he has flickering lights. His phone's ringing, and no, and no one's there. <laughs> and the walls will ooze green slime. Oh wait, they always do that. Oh, <laughs> I want that to be a meme. <laughs> it's like in twenty twenty, he's like, first there was World War Three, then the coronavirus, and then California's on fire. Oh no, wait, it's always like that. <laughs> but what was that third thing? Ebola coming back and it's gonna be like, hi, <laughs> how you doing? Well, I did hear news reports saying that Ebola did have a new strain. <gasps> I saw that on uh, iFunny and I was like, oh, come I on. Funny. It's iFunny, we could trust that. No, no, it, <laughs> I looked into it. Apparently, it legit happened. Neat. It was weird. I'm like, Ebola, go home. We already have a problem. Please don't make it worse. Except for yeah. Super AIDS. <laughs> I, I, Corona's cool. gonna go away. Corona's gonna go away, and then it's gonna, and then we're like, not. we're saved! We're done with it! <laughs> we did it. We saved the city. And then Super Corona comes out. <laughs> Who killed the dinosaurs? Me. <laughs> hey, hey. At least that gives me an excuse to finally play through my backlog of video games. Huh. Neat! I recently learned how episode. to play arcade on the Wii. How to play through arcade on the Wii? legitimate means. Well. Yeah, um wink 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 And Nintendo, before you try to go at me, think on this. It's all on you that the average person can't buy an arcade cabinet. Dang. I'm just saying if you want if you want more people to Arcade 1-Up ain't got Nintendo games on it. I wish. They, all they got is, like, Galaga and, uh, Mortal um, Kombat and Street I want Fighter. Arcade 1-Up with a, uh, Raspberry Pi in it. You know, I'm pretty sure pie? you can just get a well, Raspberry Pi with, uh, an arcade cabinet shell. Well, isn't that just a Power 1-Up thing? No. The arcade one up is actually a pretty interesting platform. Oh lord. Yeah. <laughs> They're very simple and streamlined, but they are more I, um, than just an emulation thing. I saw for like three hundred bucks one with a Raspberry Pi filled with a bunch of games. And I wanted that. Get it. I don't have three hundred dollars. Pop pop up I pop I am in unemployment right now. <laughs> Although <laughs> Although I did get an offer to work at a uh, at a paint store, I'm open for that one. Go paint, <laughs> it's a job. Paint, paint the... <laughs> I need money. Uh, Does it sound that hard to sell paint? Just know the names of the colors. Yeah. Um, do you have? Do you have um? Colonial blue. Actually, it's Carl Blue number. What? Blue number. It's Coral what? Blue number two semi. This is a disaster. Lipstick. What is? Actually, it's Coral Blue number three. <laughs> What's a disaster? This whole podcast. No, oh, no, no. This is good. This is good. This works. <laughs> I'm probably just vibing in the car in. listening to this. <laughs> Can you really Plus, you never know. We. Plus, yep. you never know. We we could be the only one who cares. Heck, we could we so could wholesome. be an underground podcast. Remember, Scott the Walls didn't really hit it big until Relax Relax said something about him. I can't be underground. I need air. No so underground air machine. No, you ain't with the what kids. They say underground when they mean something that's secret, something indie, hip. Hard to find, you know? You yes, dig? 
I don't dig. I'm not underground. We're not underground. I'm, I swear not, to a mole. I'm not a mole. Uh, why is everything in, two, in the 2000s just pink? Why do you think the thumbnails on these are pink? I have a pink border because everything in the 2000s was just pink. Even the pink? Yeah. Remember, remember them airheads? No. Cotton candy bubble gum? No. It was weird. It was like you put it in your mouth and it's it tastes like cotton candy at first, and then you like chew it up and it turns into gum. Good. Well, I, I want to. I want Cards Against Humanity just so I can get the two thousands nostalgia pack. Oh yeah, <laughs> I think one of the cards in there mentions uh, weapons of mass destruction because that's what George W. Bush was saying a lot. <laughs> I like how we were like, like, I like how we talk about like the two thousands nostalgia. Yet, um, yet, <laughs> like the main nostalgia that like we pretty much hit is just the two thousand tens. Is the twenty tens nostalgia with like, like you know, like old internet, Angry Birds, you know, YouTube poop, Vine. You guys remember Vine? Yeah, about but seven years spirit- ago now. <laughs> The spirit of Vine lives Vine, on in TikTok. Vine, Vine feels like it was here forever, but it was only there for three years. You guys know that Flappy Bird was eight years ago? Wow. Yeah. Wow. And yeah. people are still trying to sell their iPhone with Flappy Bird on it for a lot of money on uh, eBay. <laughs> you can play Flappy Bird. Oh, yeah. There was someone who made a ROM for it for the Game Boy Advance. No. You guys remember the address? You can, literally, you can, you can literally play Flappy Bird on Amazon devices. It's called Flappy Bird HD. It's official. What? Well, I don't have an Amazon device. What do you think? I got an Alexa? No, I got a Google. I got an Alexa. Why are you trying to set things off? It's like people saying, Alexa. Play Despacito. Oh, we're gonna get, uh, we're gonna get... Oh, well, uh, I set off mine. DMCA'd. I set off mine, wait. Oh. Yes. Alexa, stop. Pa. Alexa, stop. Rito. Hmm. You guys remember in 2016 where celebrities just started dropping like flies? What, the what end happened? Of it? It's kind of I... started dying. <laughs> It is all no, no, it's and everyone was running away from clowns. It started in 2014 with Rob Williams, and it just kept going until like 20, until like 2018. This didn't stop for a while. They all just died. Yep. <sighs> we try to wrap this up. Yep. Yeah. I can't say wrapping up in a bow like I did like I did a few times before because it's not quit me. Quit me. Yeah, it's okay. January. Any final, words? Any final words? Maybe hint at what um, we're watching next week, even though we don't know yet. <laughs> uh, the trailer for the trailer for me, Dave, is better than the movie. Yeah. Lego Star Wars Two holds up really well. I waited yes. thirteen years yes. and I got disappointed by this movie. <laughs> Dang. Right. <laughs> uh, be kind, rewind. We'll Say it one, Bart. I swear, I, I, I swear, now I gotta reset. Okay. Be kind, rewind, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>